Hey everybody, it's me the Silver Inferno Z and welcome back for more Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix. And in the last episode, we finished off Ventus story with the Keyblade Graveyard. And in this episode, it's actually time to start a new game. But before we do that, if you guys are hyped for today's episode, don't forget to hit that like button for your boy. And also consider subscribing to the channel as well as we do put out more content other than just Kingdom Hearts. And that was my cue to say, let's get it. So again, standard mode. You guys already know that's what we sticking with. That's what we sticking with. And after you do beat a person's part, you then get this screen right here. Would you like to skip the introduction? You will bypass the opening scenes and the basic tutorials. This is basically the prologue episode, you know, episode one of the Let's Play. Of course, we're going to say yes, we would like to skip that so we can actually continue. Where does it leave us off, Av? Where does it leave us off, Av? You guys will see. We are here again at the character selection screen. I just wanted to show that whole entire thing so you guys could actually see just about every little goody two shoes, blah, 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 blah. And we've already read this before, so we're gonna hit okay. Now then, we've completed Ventus's story. Now, it's time to choose between Terra or Aqua. But, what I think we will be doing for the remainder of how many episodes is going to take maybe 12 again <laughs> but we're going to be rocking out with the young boy Terra a disciplined young man who feels compelled to find greater strength he relies on brute force and combat play as Terra of course we will yeah look at that and yep we start off right here all over again. Today you will be examined for the mark of mastery. Not one, but two of the Keyblades chosen stand here as candidates. But this is neither a competition, nor a battle for supremacy. Not a test of wills, but a test of heart. Both of you may prevail, or neither. But I am sure our guest, Master Xehanort, did not travel all this way to see our youngest prospects in years fall short of the I line. bet he didn't. I trust you are ready. Yes. yes. Then let the examination begin. It's time to fight the balls of light. Fuse with the balls of darkness. About to say whatever you say, kid. Just as hard as us. Whatever yeah. you say. Stay sharp, then. Yep. We have to destroy the orbs of light. Now then, if you have seen my playthrough of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep, and what I mean by my playthrough at least is Ventus's part of my playthrough, because that's basically all that we've gotten up to so far because this is the first episode of the one for Terra but if you have seen it then I do want to state that uh yes we will be showing every single cut scene as they do play out so if it's going to be time to actually show like like cut scenes like these the ones that we've already seen in Ventus's story I'm still going to be showing them for Terra's story and as well as Aqua's as well so don't get mad at me, you know, that's just how the game rolls. Alright. Jeez, Terra does so much damage. Got, well, thanks, man. No, I want it. I want it. Did I get it? 
I think I got it. But we've learned critical impact as well as we gained some maximum HP. So, or at least it increased. And we already know about that, so. That was unexpected. But one must keep a still heart even in the most trying of circumstances. It was an excellent test. One I chose to let unfold. I guess so. Which brings us to your next trial. Now, Terra and Aqua, the two of you will face each other in combat. Remember. There are no winners, only truths. For when equal powers clash, their nature is revealed. Yo, I'm about to beat this girl's ass. That's the truth. Talking about there's no winners when there's only truth. The truth is, I'm about to win. Or not. I mean. Do we not get to fight? Hey, don't you smile. I, I, you know, I guess we don't get to fight. You know, I, I'm okay with we that. We have deliberated and reached a decision. Terra, Aqua, you both performed commendably. Thank you, sir. However, only Aqua has shown the mark of mastery. No, thank you. What? Terra, you failed to keep the darkness within you sufficiently in check. But there is always next time. That is all. Aqua, as our newest Keyblade Master, you are entitled to certain knowledge. Please wait here for further instruction. Hey. Terra, I'm sorry. The darkness, where did it come from? My heart? Your heart? Our heart? Where else? Come on, Terra. What do you make of Ventus? He ain't gonna cut it. Somebody's gotta break that loser in. Not here, you won't. I have to keep up appearances. I know that. He just needs a little incentive to leave home. Sorry, but I need some time alone. There's darkness within me. So what does that matter? I know I'm strong enough to hold it back. Yes, we are. You are indeed strong. Um. The darkness is nothing to fear. Master Xehanort. And yet, how frustrating that Ericus refutes its power. Why, you could train with him forever, and still, you would never be a master in his eyes. Trash! But why? Help me understand, Master Xehanort. What is it that I failed to learn? You're fine as you are. <laughs> Darkness cannot be destroyed. It can only be channeled. Yes. Thank you, Master. Isn't that a wide old man? Or a wise old man? Excuse my my language. As he walks away in darkness, you know? What happened? I don't know. Why isn't Ven here? Very well then. I will send my pupils to investigate. Yes, I understand. Farewell. That was my dear old friend Yen Sin. As you know, he is master no more. But he still keeps a close eye on the tides of light and darkness. His counsel serves as signposts on the road we wielders of the Keyblade must walk. All the more reason then for concern, for he tells me the princesses of heart are in danger. Not only from the forces of darkness, as you may assume, but also from a new threat. 
one that feeds on negativity. Fledgling emotions that have taken monster form. Yen Sid calls them the unburst. As wielders of the Keyblade, you are tasked with striking down any who would upset the balance of light and dark. That is true. The unversed are no exception. I tried to pass this news on to Master Xehanort, but my repeated attempts to reach him have failed. I doubt there is any connection, and yet this all troubles me. Master Xehanort is gone? So here we are. I need you two to get this situation under control. Eliminate the unversed and find Master Xehanort. I have unlocked the lanes between. You may use these forbidden pathways to travel between this world and countless others. The darkness looms closer than usual within these spaces, but your armor will protect you. Lastly, Remember that order must be kept. You cannot tell anyone there are other worlds. Now go and fulfill your duty. Yes, Master. Yo, we are on a mission. Terra. Consider this an opportunity. A second chance for you to change my mind. What? You must know. I care for you like my own son. I could have my way. I would name you master in a second. Well, why don't you? But how can I? When you are so obsessed with power. Terra. You mustn't be afraid of losing. Fear leads to obsession with power. And obsession beckons the darkness. You must never forget. Thank you, master. I swear, I will not fail you again. Yes, the spirit, Terra. Now then, on a mission we go. Terra! It's okay. Yo, is it time to look like a badass? It's time! Yo, tell me we don't look sick as hell. Hiya! Yo, please, can I get one of those? Like, I don't care. Give me one. I'm coming for you, Master Xehanort. We forged a D-Link with Ventus. And we don't need to learn how D-Linking works. And we've also forged a D-Link with Aqua. And we've unlocked the command board for the Land of Departure. And we've also unlocked another world. Yep. That's it, guys. Another world. But... Before we actually do go inside the Enchanted Dominion, we're actually going to go ahead and end off the episode. So, if you guys couldn't really tell, when you switch people's stories, like, for example, we did Ventus' story first, and it showed us his side of the story. Now we're doing Terra's, and it's going to show us Terra's side of the story, and what you think is going to do with Aqua's. The same damn thing. So, if you guys are hyped for the, at least tomorrow's episode, or if you guys did enjoy today's episode as well, don't forget to hit that like button for your boy, and also consider subscribing to the channel as well. But, I'm going to get up out of here. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe for your boy, and I will see you all next time.